Welcome to the Environmental Sensitivity Mapping Web Tool, an innovative solution to support environmental assessments and planning decisions in Ireland. This video demonstration presents the Web Tool's functionality. Through the layer list, it enables exploring over 100 publicly available datasets relevant to a Strategic Environmental Assessment, or SEA. The datasets are grouped according to SEA themes. They can be turned on and off for visualization purposes. And clicking on each dataset provides a description as to why they are important, who is the data creator, and when was last updated. If you want to add Additional datasets currently not available in the web tool, you can do so using the Add Data tool. The Search tab also allows uploading datasets from ArcGIS Online. Zooming closer, you can explore the features that occur at a given location. Each of the data groups can be made transparent to visualize what lies underneath. Changing the background map might facilitate this border. Clicking anywhere on the map will capture the environmental features that occur at that location and provide information about their characteristics. Any visible layer can be printed. The printout can be customized to landscape or portrait, and the format of the file defined. The widget represents the innovative part of the web tool. It enables creating context-specific environmental sensitivity maps. This can be created a local, river basin district, metropolitan, special planning area, regional or national level. For the purpose of illustration, we'll create an environmental sensitivity map for the northern and western region. The selection of the criteria that are to be brought into the analysis must be contextualized to the plan or program under assessment. This selection of criteria is entirely hypothetical. Once criteria have been selected, you can apply a wage to emphasize the relative importance of a set of criteria and perhaps in this way capture public concerns or opinion. Press Go and the widget will calculate the relative environmental sensitivity of the study area on the basis of the selected criteria and apply weights. This will take approximately two minutes. The results or output environmental sensitivity dataset is added to the layer list. And it can be turned on and off as the rest of the layers are made transparent. Data groups can also be moved up and down to facilitate their visualization. In addition, the swipe tool allows exploring the overlap between the layers. To prepare for printing, give the map a title, select the printing format, and acknowledge the author. Authorship should be defined in order to defend the rationale for using the selected variables and weights. Press print to generate the map printout. This will take a few seconds.
Clicking on the PDF, we'll open the map printer in a new tab. And you can see that for transparency, the variables and weights applied in the environmental sensitivity analysis are captured here. You can save this map on your local drive for future reference. Going back to the widget, you can adjust the weights or add additional assessment criteria. and rerun the model to explore how changing variables and weights affects the relative sensitivity of the different areas. You can repeat these steps as many times as you wish to examine the effect that criteria and weights might have on the sensitivity of the receiving environment. For further detail and guidance, please refer to the user manual. Thank you.